Waking up in the morning, thinking about so many things. Tell you how I'm doing. Not well, bitch. Pass the holy whore. Jealous of what? Your ugly leather pants? Should I bow to you? Okay. Damn it. Bad weather, tornado. Spin the truth, destroy. <laughs> Hello everybody, to welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills. Guys, I have some tea from here, from Beverly Hills. But before we get into it, like always, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do it right now, it really helps me a lot. If you are new here and you want to join the Beverly Troop, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, guys. And let's talk about this mess. Guys, it is time to talk about Dorit Kemsley, okay? Because she is basically non-existing at this point on Beverly Hills. You know, she is having like the like lowest time, screen time, you know, like we don't even know if she's there, if she even is a friend of the show, or whatever at this point, okay? But anyways, there is a rumor running around the streets of Beverly Hills about Miss Dorit Kemsley and her new venture as a wedding dress designer. Yeah, it's, it's like that, right? Anyways, so you know that out of no, I mean, not, I mean, she decided to become a designer. She tried the whole bathing suit thing, didn't work out. Now she jumped to the uh, wedding dresses thing, right? And she's actually doing a collection with this. Uh, person called Nectaria, right? And it's called Dorit Kemsley Looks Bridal Collection with Nectaria, okay? Well, guys, apparently this uh, Nectaria person is known for being a scam, a scammer, basically, okay? Apparently, she is banned in several countries, okay? And she is banned because apparently she used to charge thousands and thousands of dollars, okay, for wedding dresses who will cost just a little fraction of that. And then when the dresses were delivered, they will literally fall apart as soon as they were put on. Now, a lot of the people who were victims of this scam tried to contact her, you know, and all of this, and then she was nowhere to be found after she collected up the thousands of dollars, okay? Now, I don't know if Dorit knows this, okay? But if I'm gonna go into business with someone and I'm gonna put thousands of my own dollars and my name on a collection, you know, that is going to go out there, I will make sure that the person that I'm doing business with is as clean as possible, okay? Now, if this person is banned in several countries, I will think that you will find something about it out there, right? Especially when you have money and access to, like, actual investigators or whatever. Um... I don't know. You know the rumors, you know, that the, the rumors about PK and her and her financial status, you know, and how they uh, also are like in like shady businesses. So maybe she already know, but there is actually no way to know if she knows or not. That's a lot of no's. But anyway, you know what I mean, right? So um, I don't know, girl. I mean, look. I, for once, I look at the dresses. They are very beautiful dresses, okay? So, what I understand is that, you know, uh, Dorit is the designer, you know, and then this other Nectaria girl is the one who does the, the actual dresses. So, I will keep an eye on this girl because it will be very easy for this Nectaria girl to just produce the wedding dresses in a very bad quality and then just run 
and then Dorit will be the one who has to deal with the backlash. And especially being a public figure, it will literally destroy her career, right? So, I don't know. I mean, again, this is just the rumors on the streets. So, you know what I always said, rumors, you should not believe them 100%, but they're always out there for a reason, okay? So, I don't know. I mean, it's hard. Like, I don't see Dorit like being that kind of like evil person you know so if this is true it will be from this nectaria person um but you never know right anyways let me know what you guys think in the comments below and like always don't forget to like this video share this video subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll see you around see ya bye